Hi guys, it's White Wolf back here. I haven't filmed in a long time, and I just wanted to give an overview of all the points I've made recently. So, this is the Brazilian agate slab I worked into a point. It's probably not my best work, but it's still pretty good. I like it. This is a quartzite piece I made. It's uh, <clears throat> a hard material to work. I got it pretty thin. It's kind of hard to flake though. Uh, actually, this is a Trout Creek piece. I kind of broke this part, but yeah, it's um nice material. I have a lot more of it that I need to work. But yeah. All right. Um, this is a, I can't remember, but it's uh, pretty rare. Um, yeah, I can't remember what material is. It's really nice though. I like it. This wasn't a slab. This I might have shown in a video already. It's really thin. Um. Yeah, the good on Achi flake do. This is a blue point. Um. Yeah, this is uh, just turquoise black, uh, glass. Um, kind of flakes, kind of weird, really steppy. Yeah, you could have done better. This is another kind of Trout Creek little thing I was working on. I'm not sure. Yeah, Trout Creek chart. This is a flake I got off of a large material that I do not know. It is kind of a green material. Um, I got it really thin. Pretty symmetrical. And yeah, I tried to make an Eden or Scott's bull off out of that. I might have shown some of these on video already, and I'm sorry for that. This is a Alabates. It's a rare material. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> Sinatra I made, pretty thin, uh, symmetrical, um, really cool colors, I really like those colors, wish I could get more, fortunately it's really hard to get, I just got lucky with, um, a guy that gave me a few pieces, here's, <laughs> this is an immaculate piece. I really like the work I did on this. Really good working. I made this from a flake. Um, pretty thin. Pretty symmetrical. And yeah, it's a really cool piece. Uh, this is a little, it was kind of weird because I found a slab of agate. Uh, in Utah, like almost a pre-shaped knife blade is pretty cool. Um, I do have pictures of it, but I don't really want to go through all my pictures right now. So that'll take a while to find. Um, but yeah, uh, I like it a lot. Uh. Yeah, it's pretty thin. Cool material. Especially in the light. Too bad. It's not too much of it in here. Uh, what's next? What's next? All right. This is a, uh, I forgot, but I think it's a Jasper. Um, really thin on that one. Cool material, 
nice notches, symmetrical. Uh, the tip broke off of it when I was making it, but then I um, uh, just made it. <laughs> yeah. Um, trying to think on what to do next. So a lot of different points still. Uh, okay, this. Hold up. Alright, I just made this. This is um percussion napped. My first attempt really or not my first but my best probably had a dovetail. Um I got it pretty dang thin. Uh yeah. It's nice notching, thin at the base. Uh or like it's made out of uh Texas flint. I forgot what the town is called, but most of you probably know what it's called. It's uh, more of the blue variety of Texas Flints. Yeah, I, I really like this piece. <laughs> it's a really nice one. Okay. This is a agate from Nevada. It's uh, called Moss Agate, I'm pretty sure, or Sage Agate. It's really cool. I really like it. Um, uh, sorry. Uh, it's pretty rare. It's a material from Nevada. Uh, there's a site that I've been getting all these colorful materials from. All agates. Um, yeah, it's a cool site. Cool sight. Yeah, symmetrical, thin, yeah, good material. I like it. This is a little, uh, uh, flint ridge point that I made. It was a lot bigger, but unfortunately it broke. Split in half. This is... Uh, here, I'll first. This is Petrified Coral from Florida, I think. Got that really thin. Cool flake right here. Um, Smash Gold. Yeah, I really like Petrified Coral. This is Moo Kite from Australia. There's uh, a couple bands in it that are kind of funky. Um, it was like this long, but then it split, so I had to rework a little bit. Kind of this funky thing right here. This is old stock material, so it's not the best quality Moo Kite. Yeah, I think it turned out pretty good, though. I like that piece. Okay. This, uh, this is Trout Creek Church. This is, um, my attempt of a falsum. Uh, I kind of cheated because I found a flake that was kind of had two sides going this way and then kind of a flute already in the middle, um, at the quarry. And yeah, I got it. <laughs> I... Kind of just shaped it into a Clovis. It's pretty much all I did. Um, really cool material. Uh, bands through it. Falsum. Yeah. I really like that one. <laughs> it looks like the real deal. Uh, yeah. This is a, uh, I'm not sure, but it's, it's just type of material. Um, yeah, I really like the style I chose to do this. Kind of a flare out on the notches. Uh, 
pretty thin, probably three inches long. Uh, yeah, overall, it was really good material. It worked really easily. I really enjoyed working it, and I hope I can probably get my hands on that again. It's a cool material. Okay. Uh, uh, which one was I going to show now? Uh, I think that's it besides these two. So then, here's uh, my second attempt at napping Flint Ridge. Kind of a thicker side notch point. Uh, pretty good overall. Uh, I think could have made it a bit thinner. It's kind of an odd shape when I got it, so. Yeah. Hope I can get some more Flint Ridge, but with more colors in it. <laughs> yeah. Here's some uh, extremely rare material that he included as a <laughs> extra shipping. But, like, I did not realize, or and I don't think he did either, how rare the material was. It is from Australia, or, no, Madagascar. This is probably one of my, th or, like, my thinnest point I've ever made. Like, that's really thin. Um, it's a... It's called Ocean Wave Agate. Um, really rare. You, you can't even obtain any of it anymore. Um, uh, besides the people who already did, which I got lucky with this. It's one, like such a good material to nap. It's wonderful. It flakes super easily. It gets can get really thin. Flakes long flakes. Um, yeah, overall, it's just a great material. It naps really well. It's gorgeous, um, especially like, like that. Yeah, it's super pretty. I really like this material. Uh, might get my hands on some more somehow. But yeah, this is definitely a really nice point. I really like this one. It's a really cool point. All right, just wanted to catch you guys up on some of the points i've made recently and yeah thanks for watching and i hope to see you guys again sometime soon probably with a ski video maybe with an arrowhead hunting video probably not arrowhead hunting i think the season for arrowhead hunting is done for this season uh maybe another one of these catch-up videos but yeah thank you guys so much for watching See you guys back with a ski video from yesterday, October. Uh, yeah, see you guys later. Bye.